just for maybe a minute of the beginning of this video, I'm going to mention the person that I spoke about in the last video, which was Paul Cook. And I just need to say now, and remember this for the future, just because I, and maybe most people, mention somebody in a video does not necessarily mean that they agree with most of their work, some of their work, something they've said, whatever, right? That goes for anybody. In fact, it's the main reason well the only reason why I have not spoke or directed you to anybody else's channel since it went wrong uh, about two years ago this tank here is something I pointed out before myself and I was actually debunking it and he doesn't agree with it thankfully because that's the reason why I watched it I thought my god he's not speaking on this is he so this tank here uh, people were sharing it in links and stuff you know uh, this petrified tank uh, and he also points out that it's it's actually covered in concrete i thought it was just covered in mud because as he even says metal will not petrify right you can't have something that's turned been turned into an element and then have it petrify so these are some new images because i'm going to get into the discovery that i latched on to realized about two years ago on the viking supposed viking burials it being petrified wood these two images are just new that i threw in just for that i'll get to it towards the end uh, another video that paul put out i'll just point this out is this warning in this video here and this is exactly what i was pointing out uh, when I was pointing out the box framing, like the African house here, you can see above the artwork, yeah? So you've got a box framework square, and then you fill it in, in between, and it will harden. And that has actually petrified. That's the reason why I'm saying it and showing it. And, but some of it's rotted away. That's what you're looking at there. But it's not giant pieces of rock that's been lifted into position, right? This is mud rock, clay, something like that that's hardened around a frame some of it's petrified the framing yeah but it's turned into mud rock and because i've already mentioned another channel i'll do this and that will be it for a long time the next one i'm going to mention is hangman 1128 and some people think that i didn't give him any accolades for the last couple of videos in my final jigsaw playlist well that's because i have done it a good few times before in the earlier ones in the album all right i certainly have we me we both get on we have pushed this particular topic forward the more forward than anybody else right that's been doing this but i came to this conclusion on my own and then bumped into him somehow about five years ago i don't know how through a comment but he, he was already going out on these outings uh, himself in his own backyard basically and looking at this stuff while I was just starting to come to it through the video like no trees on flat earth right and you can see my progression in my playlist itself 